Previously, we learned about the development trend of the high-power modules. Also, the growing deployment of the bifacial module represents the high IRR behind this kind of solar module. As we can benefit from the application of these advanced modules, the DC input current is an inevitable challenge for solar inverter. The first problem is the clipping of the power generation. As most of the inverters on the market only support 13 amperes input per string, the high DC input current of the high power modules and bifacial modules will automatically be restricted to 13 amperes. In this case, the power generation will be clipped due to the hardware limit of the solar inverter, losing the advantage of the high DC current. Taking Jinko Solar, Tiger Pro, 530 watt, 72 cells module, as an example, as the imp is higher than 13 amperes, according to the IV curve of the solar module, if it is used with an inverter supporting only 13 amperes per string, the power generation in the middle of the day will be clipped, the solar module will work at lower power than its maximum power point. However, as the Goodwee HT series supports maximum 15 amperes per string, the high current can be fully utilized without limiting the imp of Tiger Pro, 530 watt module, guaranteeing the IRR for the clients. This feature is applicable to bifacial modules as well. On the other hand, as the inverter supporting only 13 amperes needs to work at the restricted 13 amperes circumstance, according to the IV curve of the solar module, the DC voltage will be higher than it's at the maximum power point. This will lead to both higher boosting voltage at the DC side and inverting voltage on the AC side, generating much more heat internally. Eventually, this improper application will both decrease the efficiency and stress the internal components as they will wear faster than the designed life. As Goodwe HT series support 15 amperes per string, it is the ideal choice for the mainstream high power and bifacial module products on the market. Please stay tuned to check out the updating video and technical documents or contact us to get more information about it.